Alright guys, welcome back to another episode of Medieval Dynasty. So, I'm actually getting really better at the, uh, trying to remember what game I'm playing. It's always so hard going about, um, playing an entire season, like, for, like, three months or whatever, and then coming back and then it's, like, starting a new one, and it's, like, really hard to remember the name, and it takes me, like, a month to get used to it again. Alright, anyhow, um, there are some things that, uh, we need to do today, for sure. Uh, we need to work on the relationship. Um, uh, it's at 100%. We just need to basically do the final thing and get her to move in, and that shouldn't take too much. It might go down maybe 1, 2, maybe 5% at the most, and then we can easily get that back up, but... Uh, it shouldn't take too long. Um, outside of that, though, uh, we can start working on... Um, we still need 15 structures, so we'll need two more buildings for sure. Uh, we don't actually have that many things that need people in. Uh, the well we can easily handle ourselves. Um, we do need a kitchen, but we also need a house as well, so it's... Because we'll have somebody in hunting, so that won't really work until we have, um, kind of a balanced thing. We'll probably put a, I think maybe a female in this one, uh, mainly because it's only a production building. And it's not like a high priority compared to hunting. So I think that would be better than if we were to go ahead and do it the other way around. Anyhow, uh, let's go ahead and see what we can craft up for the time being. See if we can't get some more gold and unlock some more stuff. We've got nine buckets. Uh, that's good. All right, so that should do us good for a little while. We got ten daubs, so we'll be able to... I think we have our hammers on us. And, you know, we really need to lower the... Um, getting way too much firewood, honestly. So, we'll maybe sell some, I'm not sure yet, or put it to the side, maybe, just so it doesn't fill up our, uh, our storage, because it does have, like, a lot of weight to it. Okay, and then we're going to want to um, make a few boots as well, so we'll do that. And got some bulls. 20 bulls. Okay, so that's about good. I think we got pretty much everything. So we'll make up those. Oh, shoot. I'm encumbered. <laughs> uh, let's see, what can we drop? Oh, we don't.
All right, so it's raining today. Uh, we got um, that food cooked up, so we can put some of this away. And I don't know if we have... Yeah, we have some cabbage still left over. So we'll put some of this in here. Um, as far as... I think we'll put about five in here for this. We'll keep five on us. And... Actually, you know what? We'll just throw it all in here. Uh, we can just make up some food. Uh, we do have another quest that we need to do. Um, part of the main storyline. But it's quite a bit of a trip. So... I wanted to... Um, see if we can't get some food first, some water, stuff like that. And then we'll see if we can't start working towards that. I don't feel comfortable going in this kind of weather, though. So we might want to hold off until another day. Um, just because the visibility isn't that great, and it's hard to see if there's any bandits along the path. And it is kind of a very shady route, so... Um, I don't know. I I know where some of the bandits are, but there are a few other nodes, I think, along that path that we need to take. So it's just one of those things that I want to make sure I can try to avoid because sometimes they spawn in... Well, one of the locations is like a huge group of them. Like, we're talking like over five people. So maybe like five or six, seven maybe. Uh, compared to one, and we don't have that good of weapons, and it takes a long time to take somebody out with a bow, so... Um, especially with our type of bow, it's just a regular bow, not a, um, res re better bow, I can't remember what it's called, it's like a reserve bow, or, or... I don't know. Anyhow, uh, we do have the meat, so that's good. Uh, we can put that down, then. And it's definitely a day trip. Um... So we'll have to get up like early and stuff like that, but um how much water do I have in here? I have ten. Well I could use a little bit. Yeah, I just hang it on the shelf here. Um it seems to put it out of the way and stuff, so it seems to work. Whoop. <laughs> when I get it actually hooked up, that is. Just a nice little trick that I've learned. You can put tools up there as well. Some tools actually fit as well. Um, for example, our bow would fit perfectly fine up there. We can put that on there. Just drop that.
grade E. So at the moment, I'm currently just digging up the um, clay pits and we'll kind of help along the production for the um, making the uh, daub. So we, we have all the resources that we need. Uh, we can just go ahead and uh, pick some uh, straw and then we'll be able to craft a couple of these up, no problem. Now this won't affect the uh, production for getting the resources. They can still obtain it quite easily uh, so without it. They just go to random nodes and stuff and they collect the stuff that they need. So it's not like we needed to have the clay here anyways. So, uh, but we should be able to get quite a bit from it. There's, I think three more nodes left that we can get clay from. So we might be able to make up to like 30 or whatever. And if we travel to um, Sambor, um, his little shack over there, then we'll be able to um, get a little bit more as well if we bring a shovel, so. So we got 39, almost enough to make um, 40. So we should be able to get some off of the. Um, well, actually, we won't. We'll just put the nine in the uh, storage. I think that'll be fine. Uh, there is 19 though, so well, we might be able to get one more. Okay, straw-wise, we're not going to be able to siphon any of that off. We'll have to pick our own, which is not too far from where we are. There's actually a lot of locations for straw. It's not just this one. They're usually along the coastline though. And we'll just pick these reeds and then we'll get straw from them. I think it's sometimes random, like you get two or three from them. So we need about 40, I think, if I remember correctly. 40, yeah. So it'll take a little bit of time to do. And they grow back like every couple seasons, so. Oh, we have like 47. I'll just get a couple more so we have a little extra in the storage. I don't know if we're running low over time or whatnot, but always good to have a little bit extra.
Alright guys, so we got um, quite a bit of this stuff done today. We got uh, some buildings upgraded. Uh, we got um, our wife. That was really important for us. We didn't actually lose any of the affection. Uh, we started upgrading the Hunter's Lodge. And then after that, what we'll start working on is the Food Lodge as well. But um, outside of that, uh, there's a beautiful day. We'll be able to see where we're going uh, next episode. So I think what next episode we'll be end up doing is we're going to go all the way over that direction. Well, it's more over that direction. And uh, then we'll be basically talking to that uh, Sam guy. And then we'll be able to kind of learn a little bit more of the story. Uh, learn basically all that stuff. But um, outside of that... Um, if you're new to my channel, don't forget to subscribe, comment down below, rate the video, and I will see you guys next time. Thanks for watching. Peace out.